Come on in. Welcome to my she shed, guys. <laughs> Happy to have you here. And on today's episode, I'm going to show you what it's like to live alone inside of a shed. Hi, welcome to Angela's Anything Show. And today, we are making a she shed. That's right, folks. Me and Dan have been spending a lot of time together during this quarantine. This house is small, so really we're just in each other's space all the time. And I was thinking, you know, I really need a place that I can call my own, a place that I can go to to be by myself, get creative, you know, express emotions without judgment. And then I realized, what do we have in our backyard, really more of a side yard? A shed, a very oversized shed, in fact. Really, the shed is way too big for the yard, but now it's gonna come in handy because I'm turning it into my sanctuary, baby. My she shed. It's a she shed summer. So, I want you guys here along on the process for the whole thing. First, we're gonna like check out what's in the shed, um, reorganize some stuff, and then fill it with a beautiful decor. So first, I guess we're gonna um, uh, go survey the land, go survey the project, and see what we're working with. Okay, let's go. Okay, here's the shed in all of its glory. You can see that we share the space with some critters at night, but that's okay, they shouldn't, shouldn't bother me much. All right. Now, you can see it's very large in here for you know, what we have. Oh. Some honeycombs. So yeah, um, this is basically the shed. There's a light, but I don't think the light actually works. No. So we're gonna need some electrical work. But overall, I'd say a lot of potential in here. I mean, I could set up, hang out, I could sleep in here if I wanted to. You know, it's just gonna be nice to have a space without having a man around because I don't need no stinking man. The shed is basically empty now, except for, you know, Few gardening supplies but that just kind of adds to the ambiance so now it's time to put up some decor and really make this space my own Welcome to my crib. Come on in. So first, you know, just ignore this. Um, first, this is my vision board. I like to look at this, visualize what I'm trying to achieve here in this she shed. Next, we have the Patriots of 1997. This is Danielle. This is who I aspire to look like and be like, and I practice posing like her. We have some natural shrubbery right here, some natural greens trying to bring in the earth into the shed. Just ignore this, this is for a bike, just ignore that. And then, you know, this is for the guests if they want to come sit here. You know, it's very comfortable because it's a couple bags of mulch and soil, but... Some it, poison too. A little bug poisoning, but it looks like, I know, I think it'll be a very comfortable seat. We is that your linen closet up there? This is some extra pillows and linens, if people want that. And then if we need to make a quick escape, there's bikes. Transportation. Yeah, transportation. You got it all. What do you think? It's my she shed. You know, a lot of people asked me when I was telling them about this she shed. They asked, Angela, are you crazy? Are you crazy? What makes you think that you can take this plot of land that you've been given, barren and all, no grass, just dirt, just sticks, 
And on that plot of land sits a shed. And what makes you think that you have the right to take that shed over and move out household items and move your things in? Are you crazy, Angela? And you know what I said to those people? It's my she shed and I do what I want to. Sitting in my she shed. Am I lonely? A little, but no lonelier than I am inside with Dan ignoring me doing work all day. When I first expressed to Dan my desire to move my belongings and possessions into this here shed, he didn't quite support the vision. He didn't quite see the vision. And I said, baby, look into my eyes. Do you see the vision? Hi, welcome to Angela's Anything Show. And come on in, welcome to my she shed, guys. <laughs> Happy to have you here. And on today's episode, I'm going to show you what it's like to live alone inside of a shed with no air conditioning at the start of summer during coronavirus. Click here for more tips. <laughs> You might be thinking, hey, Angela, she, her, very 2019. I love alliteration. And you're not gonna tell me that Zim shed, Zer shed, they shed, their shed, is as catchy as she shed. So this is my she shed. But that doesn't mean it can't be a he shed, but he sh shall not come into my shed. You know what I'm saying? is my home. Who let you into my shed? To be honest, I actually really like it in here. I thought that it might be kind of weird. I didn't know, you know, but I feel at one with nature in here. Like, I, I think that this shed is the most beautiful thing that's ever happened to me. Who let you in to my shed? Bro, I've been sleeping all day. All day. <sighs> all right. Well, thanks for watching this episode of Angels Anything Show. Thanks for coming to my she shed. See you next time. Goodbye. <laughs> Did you get him?